Welcome back to the Master Civil Engineering. This question is about the consolidated undrained triaxial test conducted on a normally consolidated clay, and we have to determine the shear parameters for this clay. The question is shown above, which states that a consolidated undrained triaxial test was conducted on a normally consolidated clay under an all around pressure of 250 kilopascal and the specimen failed when the actual deviator stress reached 240 kilopascal the pore water pressure at failure was 150 kilopascal determine the consolidated undrained angle of sharing resistance drained friction angle angle that the failure plane makes with the major principal plane in the drained condition shear stress at failure in the drained condition and we had to plot the most circle for both drained and undrained conditions first we will see what we have been given in the question for normally consolidated clay cohesion c is equal to zero confining or total minor principal stress is equal to sigma 3 is equal to 250 kilopascal deviator stress is equal to sigma d is equal to 240 kilopascal pore pressure is equal to u is equal to 150 kilopascal total major principal stress is equal to sigma 1 which is equal to sigma 3 plus sigma d which is equal to 490 kilopascal effective major principal stress is equal to sigma 1 dash which is equal to sigma 1 minus u which is equal to 340 kilopascal effective minor principal stress is equal to sigma 3 dash which is equal to sigma 3 minus u which is equal to 100 kilopascal first the consolidated undrained angle of sharing resistance for normally consolidated clay is given as phi is equal to sine inverse sigma 1 minus sigma 3 divided by sigma 1 plus sigma 3 putting the values of sigma 1 and sigma 3 we get the value of phi equal to 18.92 degrees drained friction angle for normally consolidated clay is given as phi dash is equal to sine inverse sigma 1 dash minus sigma 3 dash divided by sigma 1 dash plus sigma 3 dash putting the values of sigma 1 dash and sigma 3 dash we get the value of phi dash equal to 33.06 degrees angle that the failure plane makes with the major principal plane in drained condition is given as theta f is equal to 45 plus phi dash divided by 2 which is equal to 45 plus 33.06 divided by 2 which is equal to 61.53 degrees this represents the angle of failure plane with the major principal plane in drained conditions to determine the shear stress at failure plane in drained condition we will first determine the normal stress at failure plane in drained conditions and it is given as sigma dash f is equal to sigma 1 dash plus sigma 3 dash divided by 2 minus sigma 1 dash minus sigma 3 dash divided by 2 into sine of phi dash putting the values of sigma 1 dash sigma 3 dash and phi dash we get the value of normal stress at failure plane equal to 154.54 kilopascal now the shear stress at failure plane in drained condition is given as tau is equal to sigma f dash into tan of phi dash which is equal to 154. 54 into 10 of 33.06 which is equal to 100.59 kilopascal this represents the shear stress at failure plane in drained conditions now the mohor circle for drained and undrained conditions are plotted and are shown below this represents the failure envelope and uh, mohor circle for normally consolidated clay in drained and undrained conditions the thick circle represents the mohor circle in undrained condition and the dashed circle represents the mohor circle in a drained condition we can see the value of major principal stress in undrained condition is equal to 490 kilopascal and the value of minor principal stress in undrained condition is equal to 250 kilopascal similarly the value of major principal stress in drainage condition is equal to 340 kilopascal and the value of minor principal stress in drainage condition is equal to 100 kilopascal so this represents a procedure how to calculate the shear parameters from consolidated undrained dry axial test hope you guys found this video helpful and if you learn something from this video please subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends thanks for watching and see you in the next video guys